The collection of biomass is integral to the success of Project Liberty. In order to keep the stackyard filled with the 570 million pounds of biomass it will process each year, Liberty relies heavily on local farmers who contract with Poet DSM to provide the excess crop residue from their fields. It's twofold in my mind to the farmer. It, it provides another revenue source and it's a residue management plan for them. I know a long time ago, back when my dad was starting to farm, my grandparents and those type of things, they talked about plant population and they were planting you know, 20,000 or 22,000 seeds per acre. Today we're planting, you know, 34, 35, 36, and sometimes more seeds per acre. And so uh, there's a lot more residue out there to be taken. You know, we're taking a very small portion of our biomass off. I think Poet DSM, their collection approach has been very conservative from a sustainability point of view. Our results have shown that in most cases there was almost no reduction in yield from removal and in some cases there will be actually an increase in yield from removal. We continue to see increasing yields where we've sustainably removed stover from the growers fields, especially in high yielding corn. As yields increase, so does the amount of residue collected. But the removal rate remains constant and healthy for producers' fields, making Project Liberty's process an elegant, sustainable, and mutually beneficial energy solution.